I don't think anybody questions that a man named William Shakespeare was born and lived and died in Stratford-on-Avon. That's not the question. The question is whether he wrote the works that have come down to us under the name William Shakespeare. That is the authorship question. William Shakespeare was a commoner, and as a commoner, his life is extraordinarily well documented. But his life as a writer is not documented, so there's the blank. All the records about him show a pretty inconsequential man of business and mean-spirited in the extreme. He hoarded grain in times of famine, charged a visiting preacher for the wine he served him, took people to the small claims courts to retrieve debts. Even sued somebody for 14 pence up in Stratford-on-Avon in his last years, and then he dies and leaves no library, he hasn't even got the Bible. Not really the sort of person you'd associate with these magnanimous works of literature. 